Um, spent about two years working on security of Cisco collaboration products. So everything from WebEx uh, to phones and telepresence units, um, you know, pretty much anything that was voice or video communications uh, at Cisco. Um, got some great opportunities to work with, you know, everyone from like the White House communication teams, uh, you know, into various banks and, and other uh, industries. Um, and then, you know, had a, had a chance to join the IoT organization and joined uh, as the CTO for Internet of Things uh, at Cisco. Um, you know, Cisco's IoT business uh, largely focused on um, industrially hardened versions of other things Cisco sells. So routing, switching, wireless, uh, you know, edge compute, uh, those sorts of things. No fans, you know, uh, you know, an IP65 box that uh, is dustproof or, or waterproof. Um, you know, and then bigger and bigger enclosures for, for harsher and harsher environments. Um, spent, uh, spent about four, four and a half years there. Um, majority of that time was just visiting pretty much any customer that I could. Uh, so, you know, been out on oil rigs and down in mines and roofs of buildings and on factory floors and, uh, you know, anything I get my hands on, I'd go out and visit. And, um, uh, you know, spent uh, spent a lot of time with customers, hearing hearing challenges that they were going through, um, especially around digitization efforts, or you know, trying to take their existing automation systems uh, and and digitize them, uh, in, you know, internet connect them, get visibility uh, from anywhere and control from anywhere, and uh, you know that that led to led to maps.